Hey there, this is Jorge Lopez from Tomball Ford, and I'm doing a quick video on how to have your Sync 3 system connect to your Wi Fi so that it'll download any updates that Ford might be having pending uh, for your system. But before I do, I'd like to have you guys comment, um, ask any questions you might have, like, and share this video. Okay, well, the Sync 3 system is Ford's newest system that replaced the Ford MyTouch and I'm talking the screen that's in the radio area that allows you to control many many functions on these vehicles on, on the vehicle like uh, radio and phone and navigational functions to mention a few and there is a new brand new option that you can connect your system that will allow you to connect your system to your Wi-Fi so if there happens to be any updates the system will automatically download them onto the uh, onto the uh, the module and the vehicle does not have to be on so you can just basically uh, give it permission to connect and let the system do its thing so I'm gonna show you real quick how this is done okay we're back again and uh, we're chatting about how to connect your sync 3 system to any Wi-Fi that you have available and again, and this is for the system to be able to download any available updates from Ford. All right, so we're talking uh, about the Sync 3, like I said. And if you go all the way to the Settings button, it'll take you to this screen right here. You will swipe over until you see Wi-Fi. Select Wi-Fi. And you need to have the first option and the third option, you need to have them in the on position the Wi-Fi so that you can turn the system on view available networks is so that you can search for any available networks to connect to and then the Wi-Fi notifications are so that the system will tell you if there are any updates available so to search for any updates just just go to available Wi-Fi networks hit refresh might take a few times some reason this is not okay once it updates you will have a list of your available networks and if you're doing this at your house then hopefully you'll have your Wi-Fi uh, display on this uh, selection here and then just select the Wi-Fi that you want to connect to hit connect and that's pretty much it that's basically what you need to do in your case, you're probably going to be connecting to your home Wi-Fi, so you will need to put in your uh, password uh, because here at Tomball Ford, we've got an open Wi-Fi. You don't really need to have a, a password uh, on, on this system here. But uh, once that's done, that's all that you need to do, and then uh, have the system do its thing in the background. This is Jorge from Tomball Ford. If you got any questions, let me know. Phone number's in the screen. We'll talk to you later. Drive safely. Bye-bye.